Hey, excellenters, I have the hiccups. I'm trying to keep them down. Uh, it's 3.06 in the morning right now, and today's been Easter, which is has been a crazy day. Um, <sighs> hiccups. Anyway, um, I drove back in the morning from my hometown to where I live now because I had to work, and I worked until 5, and then I... Hiccups. Um, I started this big project of like throwing things out and spring cleaning and like trying to streamline my life because definitely it is not streamlined. So I threw away like three full heavy garbage bags of stuff, like three Yaffa blocks full of magazines and things that I don't need anymore. Um, a huge garbage bag full of clothes and shoes and stuff. And, like, I already feel ten times better, and, like, I'm just going to keep getting rid of things because, honestly, like, I don't need everything that I have for sure. And Alyssa and I are moving in together. Um, Alyssa's my best friend, and we are moving in together in the fall, in August, where we got this really sweet apartment that we're moving into. So I'm trying to get things ready for that, and just, it's crazy. But anyway, this week we're talking about our heritage, and my heritage is primarily German and English, and with a little bit of Norwegian, but my whole life, we've really only celebrated the Norwegian side of my family, so like all of our traditions, everything like that, it's all Norwegian. Um, we have the Norwegian Lord's Prayer hanging up on our walls, rose mauling, like, in our kitchen, that's how it's decorated, um... We have a Norwegian Christmas tree uh, at Christmas, like with all the flags and stuff. And um, we tell Norwegian jokes, you know. Even though I'm like literally, I'm one sixteenth Norwegian. Uh, definitely. When I was little, uh, this one time we were at the Minnesota State Capitol building, and I had this tendency to wander off. And so anyway, I crossed eight lanes of traffic and was waiting by my my parents' car because it's like where we met if we got lost. And they shut down the entire state capitol building. And the police were like, well, what does she look like? And my mom said, she looks like a little Norwegian girl. She's got blonde hair, blue eyes, and she's wearing an orange shirt. She looks like a little Norwegian. And that really doesn't have that much bearing on my story. But when I was little, I was like the... Scandinavian stereotype, really. But anyway, um, that's me. I'm, like I said, though, I'm really German and English, and I don't really know much about that. But, uh, I also, a little bit Native American, actually. Like, my mom's great-grandmother was Native American or something. I don't remember something crazy like that. But, uh, you can definitely tell from the complexion, right? And the thick, lustrous, dark hair. I'm not blonde anymore, but I'm definitely not dark-haired. Anyway, it's 3 in the morning, and I got stuff to do in the morning, and... It's kind of sad, though. Uh, you probably all heard Brian say that we're going to be taking a break. And honestly, it's such a good idea for all of us. Um, we've all just kind of been pooped out, you know? Um, Adams have been having issues with cameras, I think, and... Chris, Kirsten, oh my god, I'm so tired. Kirsten and I have been having issues with our schedule, and Linda's always busy, Brian's always busy, It's Claire's always busy, we're just, all of us are busy, and it's tiring, and it's not that we don't love you, it's just that mommy and daddy can't make it work right now. And by mommy and daddy, I mean all six of us. Okay, well, uh, I'll see you guys all later, and I'm going to try to be posting in between, too. Um, hopefully we can get some really cool dialogues going, but uh, we'll see you soon.